Hey guys and welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, welcome. If you're not new here, welcome back. Today I'm showing you guys a spring Target haul. And seeing what I found at Target, then go ahead and keep watching. So I forgot to mention this at the beginning of the video, but before we get into outfits, I do wanna let you guys know that as usual, all of the items that I'm sharing with you guys today will be linked down in the description box along with all of the sizing info for each item in case I forget to mention price, sizing, anything like that, that will all be down in the description box. So the links in the description box are affiliate links, which just means that I make a small commission off of any purchase that you make when you click on that link. It doesn't change the price of anything that you pay for, it just means that I make a small percentage and that you're just helping to support my channel. So if you do purchase with my links, then thank you so much. I really appreciate it. Um, if not, that is totally fine too. So now that I've got that out of the way, let's go ahead and get into all of the outfits. <laughs> so I already have on the first outfit that I want to show you. Um, it is just this little loungewear set. I keep feeling like I wanna reach for a pocket. These shorts do not have pockets on them, but this is from the Universal Thread line at Target, and I am so obsessed with this. Um, I feel like tie-dye is already really trendy for spring and summer. I've seen a lot of it out in stores already. So this is just a mix of like a gray and like a dark teal color. I just think it's so pretty. Um, this is definitely my kind of tie-dye because it's not super bright or crazy or out there. I just like the muted colors on this and I think it's so cute. The shorts I have on are a size small and they fit really true to size. I actually got the top in an extra small because it is meant to be a little bit oversized but I had it tucked in a little bit but this is just what it looks like um, untucked. It's pretty much a perfect size for me. I would say it fits more like a small because it is oversized so um, something to keep in mind. Um, I really, really love the shorts because they are pretty high-waisted. I like to wear shorts higher up on my waist and these ones you can pull all the way up to your belly button and they are still long enough to completely cover your butt in the back. So this is something that I would totally wear out. I just have this paired with some cute little sandals. I, like I said, I would wear this out to run errands or, you know, really anything. I think it's a really cute outfit. It doesn't look too much like I'm wearing pajamas, but um, if this isn't really your cup of tea, I am gonna show you an outfit with just the top here in a second, so. Okay, so here is the next outfit that I wanted to show you. I just kept the top on um, and threw on some denim shorts and my favorite Walmart sneakers. And this is something that is a little bit more casual and not so a lounge around at home type outfit. So um, yeah, I wanted to show you these shorts and after having them on for a minute, I am noticing that they kind of have like this weird um, creasing, bunching up <laughs> situation happening. Um, I don't really know if it's like the fit of the shorts or what is going on but it just kind of is like bubbling out in this area and um if i move at all it just wants to like crease up and the legs are kind of pulling up and it just is not not very flattering these shorts are very very high-waisted which i do like um i got these in a size six and they are true to size this is like my normal short size and um yeah i'm not sure really what's going on like they are really cute but it's just any, it's like any kind of like movement whatsoever. There is just like this weird creasing and they just keep wanting to like bunch up. So I'm not really a fan of these. Um, I would say try them on in store. Maybe it's just the sizing or I don't really know. I'm just, I mean, I, I don't know. It just looks, something looks off here. <laughs> um, so I do really like them aside from that. They, they are probably not the most flattering for your like backside area because the fabric just goes like straight down right off your butt. Um, they are long enough though to cover your butt, which is nice and they kind of go up on the side to show a little bit more leg. Probably if you're looking for shorts like this, go try them on in store. I'm not gonna completely not recommend them because I don't know if it's just like the sizing on my body or like, I don't know what's going on, but it's just like, it's not, I don't know what is going on, <laughs> but it's just not working for me. So um, 
I will link them anyway and you can check them out, try them on in store. Maybe this won't happen for you. I don't really know what's going on, but yeah, I just wanted to show you the outfit anyway so you have an idea of uh, how cute this sweatshirt is. Um, so yeah, let's go to the next outfit. So this is the next outfit. This is probably one of my favorites. It's super casual and basic, but I really like it. Um, I got this graphic tee in the women's graphic t-shirt section. I do look in the men's because um, they have really cute graphic tees too, but this is a women's one. Um, I got this in a size medium and I'm probably going to take this back and return it for or exchange it for a size large because I do wish it was a little bit oversized. It kind of fits like a little bit snug, like it fits like a small. Um, so I would say size up. I prefer like a little bit of a larger fit for t-shirts um, anyway. So just preference, but of the camo on it, it just says music television, MTV. Um, yeah, I just really, really like this. So I paired it with these black shorts, which I am so impressed with these shorts after the other ones that I tried on. They were kind of a disaster and, th and these ones are just so much nicer. Um, they do have like a little bit of stretch to them. I got them in my normal size. They are true to size. They fit really great. They are obviously um, high waisted, but they're super comfortable. And I really like the length of them. They're not too short at all. Um, but they're just really really cute. I, I don't have any like black shorts at all. So I really needed some um, I love how the buttons are also like this matte black all the little hardware is matte black and I thought that was really cute um, So these are from um, So these are also from the universal thread line as well. I just put this on with my um, Same little sandals. These are Mark Fisher sandals, which I just got. I'm absolutely obsessed um, I'll link these down below along with any um, shoes that I put on or any extras like that. Um, they'll be linked down below as well, but I really, really am obsessed with these sandals. So here is the next outfit. I just threw this bag on because I had to show you guys like how perfectly it matches with the color of this top. Like I cannot get over it. I think it's so cute. I just had to throw that on to show you. I'm so obsessed with this top. It is just like the most incredible feeling fabric. It's literally like buttery soft. It's so smooth. Um, like I said, I love the color of it. It's like a warm kind of yellowish brown color. I just think it's so cute. Um, I paired it with these shorts. They're kind of doing that like funny like creasing thing um, that the first pair was doing. I think these are like the same style. They're the same brand, um, same size. These fit me a little bit better, but they're still doing that like kind of crease. I don't know if it's just the type of shorts. Like I really don't know. Um, I'm not used to it in any other pairs of shorts that I have. So I'm just kind of like, what is going on? I think it's just might be the fit. I really don't like it in the lighter pair of shorts, but this one with like the distressing that's going on, like it's not, for some reason it doesn't bother me as much in these. Um, and I really, really like these. They kind of go straight off your butt like the other ones, but they do have a lot of fabric to cover your butt and I really, really like that. Um, I do like that they are super high-waisted. Um, I just threw on my little leopard print sneakers from Walmart. The color of this shirt just goes super well with like the leopard on my sneakers. And the belt I got at Target as well last year, so I'm not sure if it's still online, but if it is, I will link this as well. It's one, like one of the only belts that I wear. It's my favorite. Um, but yeah, here is this outfit. Okay, so here is the next outfit, which I actually almost forgot to include in this video because it was in the dryer. I wore this exact outfit like two days ago and it was in the dryer, so it's a little bit wrinkled, so sorry, but I had to include this. You guys probably know that I'm not really like a dress wearing type person, but a t-shirt dress, 
I can be like I can get on board with I am obsessed with t-shirt dresses I love this color so 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 much it looks a little bit like heathered and faded in some places I really really like this I'll show you what it looks like without the jacket on but I just wanted to show you the outfit um, I wore it with those Mark Fisher sandals so here is the dress without the jacket on it is not too tight it's not too loose fitting like I think it's just like the perfect size I got mine in a size small this is the universal thread line um, and I'm just obsessed like I don't know what else to say about it um this dress by the way does not come tied um, I put a little clear let's see if I can get this off so that's a little hard to do I just took the little tie out and it looks crazy wrinkled I washed this and dried it with the tie and the dress and I totally didn't even think to take it out but if you're wondering also how how I tie my t-shirts or anything I just use a little clear elastic just like this but this is just what the dress looks like without anything tied in it so when you have this little tie it just kind of gives it something extra it looks a little more form-fitting it's a little more flattering but not too tight like in your belly areas or anything it just kind of um, flatters your legs and your hips a little bit more so I really like that and yeah this is totally probably I know I said the second outfit I should was my favorite but I think this is my favorite thing I got um, so yeah okay so here is the next half I feel like I'm a little bit taller in this mirror I have wedges on <laughs> Um, but here's the next outfit. Um, I am obsessed with this t-shirt. Um, this is another one of the little women's graphic tees. Um, this was $12.99 as well. This one is a size medium also. So I don't know about the MTV shirt. It was just really, really small, but this one has that little bit of like, a uh, little bit of a looser, like oversized fit that I really prefer. And um, it's really soft, it's very comfortable. It is a short sleeve shirt, and I just paired it with these white shorts. I don't know if you can tell, but they are doing the weird, like, wrinkly, creasing thing again. I don't know if, I feel like it's me at this point, like how is every pair of shorts doing this? I tried all of these shorts on in store, which I never do. I was really not sure about sizing, so I tried all of these on in store, and they fit fine and now that I'm like trying them on at home it's like what is going on like this is just not very flattering <laughs> I don't know what's going on um, so yeah just use caution if you buy these shorts that's all I, I don't know maybe it's just me um, but I paired this outfit with this blush cardigan it's kind of like a beige but online it's called um, blush it's not very pink to me it's just kind of like a I mean it has like a slight hint of pink in it but it's like a basic beige color um, I just thought it paired really cute and like matched this like leopard color top really well and I put on these um, espadrille wedges that I think just match the outfit like perfectly so this is like probably my go-to like spring type outfit that's like a little bit dressy um, but still pretty casual yeah I really love the outfit I just don't know how to feel about the shorts let me know in the comments if you're watching this like is this normal am I just like freaking out does it look like it looks crazy right like <laughs> like I don't know what's going on <laughs> Okay, so the last thing that I have to share with you isn't really an outfit. I didn't find jeans at Target, so I just threw on a pair of jeans that I had in my closet. But I just wanted to share this top with you guys. It's just like a tank top, but I love the fit of this. It has this little higher neck. It kind of reminds me of like a halter top, but it's not. Um, I also am not wearing like the proper bra with this it's a little bit see-through I would recommend wearing a nude bra I just have on this like bralette from Target which is one of my favorites I can link down below also but <laughs> I wouldn't recommend anything other than a nude bra because it is a little bit um, see-through but they have other colors of this I just I like the fit of it it's not like a normal tank top it's a, something that's like a little bit different and I really really like it 
they have this in a really gorgeous like camel color um, that's really really pretty they had a lot of other colors in store as well it's also got a little bit <laughs> Um, I don't know if you can see, but it's a bit ribbed as well. Um, it's just really, really, really basic. I always need more like white basic tops and I just really love this one. Um, so yeah, I just had to share this with you. I also wanted to show you guys that I have that same like blush cardigan. I also have in a gray. I got this one last year and it has held up so nicely. It's really, really soft still. It's not really falling apart. It's just really great quality, so if you are a, like cardigan obsessed like I am, you'll really, really enjoy this one. Um, it does have little pockets, which I forgot to show you on the blush one, but it is really nice, and I've had it for like a year now, and it's held up really great. I believe that they also have this color online again, which is the gray. Um, it's kind of like a dark charcoal gray, and the other one that's blush is like a more light, normal looking beige. Um, I just wanted you to see the color. It's just really, really cute. Um, so yeah, that is pretty much everything that I have to show you guys. I don't know what happened, but I completely spaced and forgot to film an outro earlier. So here I am back two hours later after I filmed on my phone, on the couch, about to edit my video, and I'm filming an outro now. So um, thank you guys so much for watching. Let me know if you like this video. Feel free to leave a thumbs up or a comment or anything like that letting me know you like the video. Um, if you have any other video ideas or other stores that you would like to see me shop at, because this is my first Target haul. Um, if you have any other stores or any other video ideas, like I said, go ahead and leave those in a comment down below. And if you're not already subscribed, if you like this video, if you like my channel, go ahead and subscribe to my channel. And yeah, thank you guys so much for watching and I hope to see you next time. Bye!